Hello guys, do you like intro? Then don't forget to like this video too. So, we have a new festival, Kite Festival, where you can get up to 2100 kites for logins, consuming energy and killing monsters. I won't say that rewards are the best, but I'll tell you what to buy and explain why. Relics or pets? Totally relics, because as great pets won't give you higher attack and health than relic equipments. I recommend the Meteorine as it gives attack and what I like about it, its skill, increased bigger probability of items dropped. Let me explain why you should buy it. As you know, in passing stages we have better rings. For example, I use Werewolf Ring against healers and vampires. But I stop passing stages and focus on farming. And to farm higher stage I need enough attack to pass a stage. I farm on stage 94, because it has 40 rooms and I get around 20,000 coins. With Dimitri Rin equipment and pet wrapping is much better. If I wouldn't have it legendary plus 2, I would farm like stage 62. So why do you need to farm high stages? As equipment and pet wrap rate is the same. Because of gold. Higher stage, more golds you get. Just look at the prices for talents. For the last 600 cards, I recommend to buy all golden tickets and talent stones, as they are the rarest currency. For those who's not sure to buy Pantball Pass or not, I recommend to buy. 20 golden tickets will help you to be in top 15 in Neon's battle and to collect all frames. By the way guys, about frames, who hasn't noticed on some frames you can see S1, which means season 1. In rules for Neon's battle you can see when it ends, and you have less than a month to collect all frames, so hurry up guys. And that's all by now, don't forget to subscribe who hasn't done it yet and follow my Instagram page.